In addition to the schedules, you can use Savvy Line Sets to create a 2D section of hanging items. Select the Line Set Section tool and then insert at the origin. This will create a section object and a section item object for each hanging item. You can flip the section about its origin. Set the grid height and maximum out trim. I just want to mention that the section object also works in any angle. So if we're drawing our section off to the side, we can just rotate it at 90 degrees. Now let's insert a line set schedule to match. Now let's add a mini line set schedule around the mid rail as a reference. So let's select one of the line set items. And we can quickly add a border and leg by checking the soft goods option and set their length. We also assign soft goods to a separate class. And set the items trim in object info. I notice that that trim is now reflected in the schedule. You can also grab the item and drag it to trim. And then refine that number back in object info. Preference setting determines if soft good trim to the bottom or to the batten. The trim field will also accept the keywords in, out, and grid. Let's just draw a sight line now. The baton itself can be any symbol. So for example, we can do a track or a truss. Here we'll do a double baton. We can also embed geometry directly in the item. So we can choose edit from the menu item or double click on a line set item. Let's just insert a source for savvy section. Now we can easily drag that to trim. and flip it around the other direction. Refine it a bit with nudging. And then finally make that a nice round number in object info. And this trim data will ripple across to all of our schedules. So let's double click on this item and add a symbol representing a practical in section.
bring that to trim. And here the item height ensures that we're trimming to the bottom of the chandelier. So we give it an item height of 2 foot 10, the height of the chandelier. We can enter the label for the schedule right in object info for the item. And our schedule is updated. You can move an item by clicking the pull down menu. Line sets with an asterisk are in use, so it's pretty easy to figure out what line sets are empty and move our item. And all of our schedules get updated. So here we have a full section with legs, borders, and electrics all synchronized to the schedule. Here, this pipe symbol is changed to a track. And we can hide or show a lift line item by item. And if we don't want any pipe to show, just delete that symbol name. 